Yeah, we're going to start an adventure ride somewhere. Might as well be somewhere nice. We're just on the outskirts of Gloucester. Can't remember the name of the lookout. I'll put it up. But um, yeah, going to meet up with a couple of other guys from Newcastle. Do a lap around the Barrington Tops and a bit of a camp overnight. So should be good. Let's see how we go. First, we've got to get into town and catch up with them. All right. Down we go. So I'm going to meet these other guys. Just in the servo in town. And we'll uh, go from there. Out through some of the most scenic roads I think I've ever been on. And end up at a campsite that I've never been to. So should be good fun. It's a pretty striking town now, Gloucester. Look at the backdrop. It's just this wall of rock. Pretty awesome. Massive chunks of rock. It gets quite busy here. It's a bit of a tourist sort of a route. People do laps from Newcastle up and just make this part of the circuit. All right. Actually just got lost in Gloucester. I found pretty well every church. Done a bit of a lap. All I had to do was stay on the road I was on. So they've all caught up. Ready to rock. Yeah, a bit of a yarn, a bit of a laugh. And head out to Kurikabark Road. I probably said that wrong as I usually do. And um, yeah, wind our way west from there. So I've been going along this road for about probably 20 k's. It's just looked much the same the whole way, just rolling valleys, little creeks, crystal clear creeks. The old house like this one, they live in some pretty quiet little places. Be fair run to the old shop, but mate, if you want peace and quiet, So anyway, we're going to go up to uh, Pignabani River. There's a sort of a crossing up here in about 15 k's, and we'll um, might pull over and grab a feed. Get around 12 o'clock, check out the river. S 
soak up a bit of this on the way. Keeps on giving. Every hill you come over is just damp. Eventually we'll get back into the forest, but for now, woohoo! Slow down a bit. She's um yeah, she nice. So we're just about at Carter's Road, I think. There it is. Carter's Road, let everyone regroup. <laughs> oh no, we're getting there. <laughs> yeah, we've got to get up there now. And um, oh, oh sorry, 28 k's. <laughs> it was 10 k's to here. <laughs> but um, yeah, probably a bit over half an hour, eh? Oh, they're pretty as. The water's crystal clear too, back at those, some of those ones. Yep. Like bloody gin water. Yep. Yeah, this Pignabani River should be the same. Yeah. Should be super clear. Bloody cool down a bit on it. Yeah. Alright, we'll go up. Yep. Go. Alright, Carter's Road. So this one takes us up the top, top of the hill. Up into the high country. We're still pretty low here because I'm um, pretty hot, so we're not very high up. And we just, yeah, slowly cruise our way up. Like I said, we'll go to that Pignabani River. There was a campground there, we'll just have some lunch, cool down. What do we got? 26 k's. Okay. Somewhere. What is it? Oh yeah, I see. It's west inside. Look at that little trout stream. Let's go check it out better. We'll go up here. Ah, that's better. to go we've got 27 k's to the top of the Barrington's and um, yeah see how we go getting up here <laughs> too easy and a nice looking bite the old T7 Phew. All right, up we go. 
27 k's to the campground apparently well one of them we're gonna have a bit of a look around Daryl on the T7 he's um, been up here reasonable amount so he um, there he said there's quite a few to pick from so we'll pick the nicest one but look at this our Pignabarni definitely a trout system I've um, been here fishing many years ago like 30 so we leave the creek and we go up. <laughs> We're on Polyfugal Road now, I think. That's what Carter's Road turns into Polyfugal. Maybe this is the Pignabani again? Possibly. Kind of lost. That's right. Story explained in a minute. <laughs> so, a couple in that little Suzuki, completely lost, and trying to get the Gloucester. So they're pretty well 60 k's from it either way they go. So we're going to take them into um, the Barrington Tops Road, or at least point to where it is and they can follow that straight down the mountain because they are all over the shop with directions. Anyway, we'll get them out of here. Okay. So they're getting closer. Bloody nice though up here. They're getting a scenic tour. I don't even know where they were um where they came from to to end up out here. Like from here to Gloucester is just the whole mountain range. So I don't know. I don't know how they I don't know, I'll ask them later. Anyway, keep going. All right, Pheasant Creek Road, Gloucester 65. Not that we're going, not that we're going to Gloucester, but I will tomorrow. Yeah, the couple in the car will be um, feeling a whole lot better now. Half a tank of fuel, doing laps around the back of nowhere. <laughs> Not good. All right, not too far from our campsite. Well, hopefully, we'll see what it's like. See what we think. I think this is a little Manning. And I guess this bridge is gonna be the river. So this is that same river system. I'm pretty sure that we crossed over before. Look at it here, eh? Here's the trickle campground in there but we're going to do some more um, having a bit of a look hopefully a little quiet spot with nobody and we'll go from there Ideally near the water. Which oh 
looking good. <laughs> yeah. Beautiful. See? Is awesome, isn't it? Yeah, it's all that wood. <laughs> I was gonna say, there's not much wood laying beside it. No. Go on now. Awesome. Good, got rid of that wood. That was a good little camping spot. No mozzies, I had just a couple. I've seen a couple of leeches, that was about it, but literally two. A couple there that were nice and quiet. Pretty good. A few people here, but I didn't hear anyone. We we're probably the noisy ones. Trying to find trout in darkness after a few bourbons is interesting. Anyway, out of here, and um, this is Pheasant Creek Road. We go left, we end up joining the Barrington Tops Way, and uh, yeah, heading to Gloucester across the top. Apparently, uh, Daryl was saying it was um, been closed for a long while with landslides, and only opened up six weeks ago, so I didn't know any of that. So, anyway. Probably see a bit of reconstruction. All right, let's go. Enough gibbering.
Well, that's pretty well it. Out of the mountains. Cruise on home. Soak up some of this nice country and um, yeah. If you like the video, give us a thumbs up. Always good. Yeah, leave a comment if you like and uh, we will catch us on the next one. Wherever that is. Alright, cheers guys.